Hello, my name is Emily. Hi, Hi Emily. Emily. And my question is, if Titans just came to life right now, just like bear, bear, crash down the building, oh. what would be your plan of attack? Run. <laughs> <laughs> Does it have to be an attack plan? <laughs> what would you do? What would, what would you do? What would you do? What would I do? Realistically. Realistically, I would try the best I could to get everyone out of harm's way and then die. <laughs> I'm being honest. That's, that's probably what I would do. First off, that's a terrifying concept. You have a terrifying imagination. Thank you. Um, you're welcome. Maybe they're into Philly cheesesteaks and we could just distract them that way. Oh my god, that's brilliant. Oh my god, wow. yes. I would probably do the same thing. Like, I would probably, like, be too scared to, to fight them, but I would be more focused on getting answering this seriously. I would try and get everybody out. That's probably what I would do. Honestly, that's realistically what I would do. Trina's like, no, nah, man. Deuces. <laughs> I can be like, oh, that's awesome. A giant titan has just ripped the ceiling off of this building. Bye. <laughs> I mean, like, let's, like, okay, realistically, like, oh, yeah, there's a lot of people here. They could reach down and grab people, but then there's a bunch of light up here. Like, sorry, guys, but I'm out. Like, I'm not going to ask them to be like, oh, well, I live there. Like, no, yeah, I'm out. There is a there's an emergency exit right behind that stage, and I'm out. I am out, out, Audi 5000. Like I don't even care. Like I'm that I'm that girl that in the zombie apocalypse, my plan is to eat a bunch of carbs and then like call it. I'm not. I'm the person that the hero finds in the house, like in her bed, like ate too many carbs, had some sort of like cardiac arrest because I ate so many bad things, and I'm like, oh yeah, zombie apocalypse. No, thank you. Like, and then they raid my house. What zombie show or what what does that happen? No, it totally happens. Like the people, like the heroes go out and they're like, they're tired and whatever. <laughs> they do. Yeah, it's true. And, and they go out and they're tired and they've like already fought a bunch of people and like the audience is really tired because they've like dealt with a lot of stress and so finally they come upon this house and they're like, I don't know, maybe we can get in. And they break a window and they get in and like the girl goes upstairs, she's like, ah! And the guy's like, what's wrong? And she's like, if they killed themselves, they're dead. But they're happy. <laughs> they're not getting eaten. They have, like, cheese whiz all over their face. They're like, goose. And they're like, oh, what are we going to do? We'll just have to take the supplies out of this house. <laughs> and she's like, these supplies are my supplies. And now she becomes the villain of the episode because she has to defend her cheese yeah. whiz cash. Yeah. So, <laughs> sorry. I'm not noble. <laughs> I'm like, guys, everybody make for the... Like, no, I'm like, deuce. <laughs> I do the same thing, it's okay. Same thing. Uh, good question, awesome. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yay. Yay. Hi, Hi, salute. Hi, my name is Caitlin. Hey, Hi. Caitlin. Um, if Mikasa and Levi were in a fight, who do you think would win? Oh, um, oh. ouch. No, I'm teasing. Go ahead. Uh, Gosh, I don't know. That's a tough one. Mm -hmm. I think it depends on the day. Have, yeah. they been, have they been fighting Titans? Have I fought more Titans or has he fought more Titans? Am I well rested? Maybe did I spend a day at the spa? Here's my question. Here's my question. Is Aaron's well-being ah. known to Mikasa? Because if, his, if there's any question to him being alive right now, Levi would win because she would not be able to focus. Aaron is out of the picture. Aaron is what? Aaron is out of the picture. Aaron's out of the picture? Oh, yeah. She's making away. this really difficult Levi, point. all day, every day. Like, because if, if, if Aaron was dead, I'd be like, whatever, man. Like, and she said she wouldn't give up again, but come on. That girl, that girl's crazy. But in like a, if, like, Aaron's over there by a tree going, like, no, you guys, you go. Yeah. <laughs> then, then uh, that's a real tough call. That's, I'd call either a draw, or I might give a slight inch to Mika, so. Yeah. So that's it. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank no you. <clears throat> What's up? Hello. Hi, my name's Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Ryan. Oh, I thought you said your name was Ramen. I was like, <laughs> love Ramen. <laughs> I have a quick question for Matt, and then yes. I have one for all three of you. Um, my question for Matt is, on a scale of 1 to 10, how much are you like Levi when it comes to cleaning? <laughs> <laughs> I'd put myself at like a three. 
I'm not a filthy person. I'm just a little disorganized. Uh, I, you know, have one of those like I'll, I'll put this here so I remember it later, and then it'll be there for like two weeks. And like I should probably take care of that. Um, dishes tend to pile a bit. I put myself about a solid three or four. Yeah. All right, and then my question for all of you is, what was probably your favorite line to do as your character? <clears throat> hmm. Not as my character, but can I say the favorite line of the show? Mm -hmm. Sure. Aaron, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Josh. That's my favorite. No! 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 Um, <laughs> I bet he hates that. <laughs> His favorite line. Um. <laughs> favorite line. Um, Matt, do you have an answer? I have to think. Uh, I would say, I, I don't remember verbatim, but the, the sequence where Levi is on top of the female titan's head and they have her captured in the forest and he's just like this cold murderous just speech about exactly how he's going to pull her apart and inspect oh. her and destroy her. It's just, oh, it's just deliciously like sociopathic and awesome. I love it. And then what happens, Matt? <laughs> And, and then the episode ends on a cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Annie. <laughs> That's cute. Um, I, <clears throat> one of my favorite characters, uh, I have a couple favorite, but um, I, I love Erwin. Like, I love the character Erwin. And uh, <clears throat> there's, throughout those episodes where they're in the forest, I don't, God, like for how many episodes? Like three or four or something like that. Um, <clears throat> When they're rushing through the forest and when the female titan is chasing them, there's a there's a part where there's like a couple episodes where Aaron is just like, should I should I transform? Should I do this? I don't know. What should I do? And they're all following Levi, and they don't know what the plan is. And then eventually they they learn that you know it's been Erwin's plan all, all along. And you kind of learn in this one moment where the female titan runs through the trees and then they uh, they fire the whatever those things are you know that capture her right before your speech. <clears throat> and um, I just love that one moment where it's just so silent and Erwin uh, just yells out, FIRE! And then it's just so epic because you're like, oh, oh, that's why we were following his orders. Okay, because he's badass and it's Erwin and that's why Levi's squad trusts him because Levi trusts Erwin and he knows that, you know, Erwin's got a plan. And I don't know, I just, I thought that was really cool. Yeah, and how'd that end? Huh? <laughs> how'd that end? How'd that end with Levi's squad trusting Erwin's plan? Badly. Yeah. <laughs> Dinner! Uh, yeah. So, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Hi. Hello. Hi.